channel and Crafty Lady Era. Guys, today we're going to do a very special project. So let's get started. Come on. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Era. Guys, today we're going to do an outside birdhouse. So what you're going to need is a birdhouse. I bought this at Hobby Lobby for $10. Sometimes I'll have these at 40% off, but when I bought it, they didn't have it. Now this normally comes with a like a jute string, but instead I went ahead and took the jute string off and put a chain. We're going to hang it up outside. You're going to need some sticks, any kind of sticks. These are sticks that I got from outside. I just got them in my yard, all these sticks. And I also have these ones in case you want to use these. These I bought, I bought these ones, this one and this one at Dollar Tree. There's so many of these, these are cool. These, I got these at, Hob at Hobby Lobby during Christmas time. When Christmas comes around, I buy about six, seven of these, because they come in handy. I'm always doing little gnome houses and stuff. You're gonna need some napkins, any kind of napkins, because I'm gonna use it for part of the birdhouse. Much pudge on there. You're gonna need brown paint and white paint. Okay, well with all this being said, let's get started. Okay, first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to paint. I'm sorry about that. I'm going to paint the birdhouse white because when you put the napkin, you want it to uh, stand out. So it doesn't have to be perfect. Um, just, you know, just paint whatever you. So all this is going to be white and I'm going to paint this, the top brown. Okay. Um, this is going to come out super cute. I've always wanted to make a birdhouse. I painted the, the top brown and this white because when I put the napkin on here, it'll show it'll show the napkin better. And I painted the roof brown because when I put these, it'll blend in with the with this these twigs. Okay, so I'm gonna let it dry a little bit and I'll come back and we'll, we're gonna start mud pudging on the the house. Okay. Okay guys, now we're gonna go ahead and mudge punch this napkin on here. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take off this uh, this layer. When you mud punch, you just wanna make sure it's this one thin layer, okay? All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put a little bit of mud punch on here. We can go ahead and put the napkin. Okay. You can cut the napkin or you can tear it. I'll cut it. And now you're gonna do you're gonna have to do little pieces at a time. 
I need a lot of blending, don't worry. So, let me see. Okay. We're just gonna mud pipe this on here. Okay guys, this is how it turned out. I thought it came up really nice. Now
here. And uh, now I'm going to put a little bit of moss around here to make it look a little kind of like woodsy rustic. Okay. Backing up. Make sure you get all the strings. Now, let me go ahead and put some of this moss, a little bit of moss up here on the top. What right about up here? Just, you know, just kind of a little bit. Just
everyone. Here's a finished product. Until next time. Bye.